be here. Oh, I decided to film outside today and the birds were right beside me so hopefully it's not too noisy plus not including any birds outside but it's a nice afternoon even though it's winter here it's a nice sunny afternoon so I thought I'd just film outside because first I just wanted to have a chat um you might have guessed by now that I've sort of fallen off the no sugar wagon and haven't been doing too well with that the last few weeks probably two maybe three weeks I found the more sugar I've had, the more I've wanted, and the more I've wanted to eat. Um, so I definitely know for a fact that for me, sugar is no good. It um, improves my, it increases my appetite quite a lot. It makes me crave more sugar, and it reduces my energy levels a lot as well. So, and also, also causes me to gain weight <laughs> because of all the rest of it. So definitely need to get back off the sugar. Quite a few people online I found. Um, two sort of challenges I'm joining in with. One is for, with um, Truly Jess, who's got the Truly Committed campaign going for July. Um, hers is food and exercise, but, well both of them are, but hers is particularly food and exercise based. And there's also another one with uh, Fit to Fab, I think it is the name, no, Fit, Fab to Glam. I'll have to check the name of it. Um, I'll put them down below anyway. Uh, she's an Australian YouTuber. Or the nosy bird, uh, looking to lose quite a bit of weight. So she's got a July challenge going as well. Uh, I think hers is predominantly food based, but um, obviously they both go together. So I've kind of so I put my hand up for both of those challenges. So my plan of attack for July is in the food department, firstly to get off the sugar again. So no processed sugar again. And for the first week I'll be a bit lenient in the rest of the, the food department um, but obviously the goal is to get back into clean eating as well but the first week I think I'll just do whatever it takes to get through no sugar that's what I've done before in the past and it's worked and after about a week my appetite's gone back down my energy levels have increased and then I've been able to concentrate more on the, the clean eating aspect in conjunction with the no sugar so I'll do the same again this week um, see how I go and so that's it for um, for diet basically. That's going to be it. And then exercise. I'm going to do um, the Red Cup Ready program that I did a while back. Um, Valerie's had quite a few programs that I've um, participated in, but this is the um, the bikini body one. That's sort of the best one for um, fat burning. Which is got, I like the um, Action Hero Babe one as well, but that's a lot more. Um, we were toning more strength so I actually enjoyed that program better but this is sort of the better one for fat loss so I think I'll go with this one again the only thing with them is the it is a 40 minute um, strengthening plan which really should be fine but on the if I really don't want to do the exercise and I'm really struggling I would just challenge myself to do one of her um, um, they call it SASE I think it's short and sweet exercises like that and they're about 20 minutes so if I can't come at doing the 40 minute program I will do the other one but I'd like to sort of commit to doing that and that's like a six week plan um, and I have also ordered the um, Turn It Up DVDs the um, are they just called Turn It Up? or the Beach Babe DVDs I've, I've been interested in them for a long time and I always put them off thinking the two advanced you know jumping and things that I can't do um, I'll never do any jumping again because my heel spurs, so that's just totally out no matter what size I am. Um, but I know how to modify a lot of exercises, and even Valerie's exercises sometimes I have to modify. But I'm probably not, I'm probably, um, what's the word? I probably don't have enough belief in myself that I could probably do more than what I think I can do um, with modifications, certainly. So I, so I've, anyway, I've ordered them and they're on their way, so, but I'm going to start, um, the bikini or my bikini body program to start with and then when the other DVDs come in I'll decide but the goal no matter what program I'm following is to exercise six days a week um, three days strength training three days cardio and so there's a minimum of 20 minutes but like 20 to 40 minutes and then that's on and then plus walking the dogs for 20 minutes a day or minimum again a minimum of 20 minutes 20 to 40 minutes I'd like to get into longer walks as well so shoot, it's like 40 minutes minimum exercise a day all up. I also want to try and incorporate yoga, but I'm not sure quite how, quite how to do that. 
Uh, luckily it's school holidays at the moment, so I might wait to like a morning exercise session in and then maybe get another one in the afternoon, maybe do the yoga or something in the afternoon. It's just prioritizing it. I know that's what I've got to do. It's just prioritize it and then do it. Um, my arthritis has been acting up a bit lately, so often at times I don't feel good, but then I come good again, so even I have to put it off until I feel better, then do that. But I don't feel bad all day long. Like even this morning, I didn't feel great, but now I feel okay, so I could do something now if I was motivated and committed. So that's the plan for the rest of the month. If you want to join in the chat, either of these challenges or just follow along with me, let me know. Um, if you're doing, you know, truly dresses or the fit. Fab to glam, fit to glam, I think it's fit to glam. Uh, challenge, let me know as well so I can sort of um, follow along uh, your progress. And my main goal, obviously I want to lose the weight that I've regained. <laughs> That's probably another one goal, get back to where I was a few weeks ago. Um, but I just want to feel better about myself and about the way I'm eating and get that energy back because I have a really good energy. Charlie's getting this. Shh, Charlie. And just get the energy back, back again. Anyway, I I won't. I think what I'll do is maybe do a weekly update, so that kind of keeps me a bit accountable. I had thought about opening another channel up just to do sort of weight loss and fitness stuff, but I think I'll just keep it here, and it's easy. I'll just identify it. Um, it's to me, I guess, it's a truly committed challenge. I don't know, of course, something else. I'll think about that, but it'll be easily identifiable anyway. So if you want to follow along on my progress, you can. If you're not interested, obviously, you don't need to watch them. That's the beauty about YouTube and um, titles. <laughs> and I try and do that so that you can follow what you want and ignore the rest. <laughs> uh, okay, I will check in here again next Wednesday. Talk to you later. Bye.